Cup gang, okay, Chichi can here, about to react to, I don't know if you want to about to react to, I know it's about this Kai Senat story that's going on, this Andrew Schultz, is it Andrew Schultz, Andrew Shoes, yeah, Andrew's take on it, the Kai Senat story, like I've only heard a few things about the rape allegations against his friend in his party, some such, like, man, long story, long story, let's just get it, I don't understand, it was... <laughs> What do y'all think about the Kai Sinat uh, situation? I don't know a ton about it. Basically, like, on... There was a party. Uh, allegedly, there's a girl at the party. Uh, she gets drunk. She gets drunk. He's like, don't go home. You know, you could... You could get hurt or something like that. Like Just you sleep upstairs. Why don't you go to sleep upstairs? Allegedly, one of his homies goes upstairs and then uh, rapes her. Yeah, allegedly. I think that's bad. Yeah. yeah. yeah I think that's bad. It's bad. And then also there's... <laughs> yeah. What, like, do you, what do you think about it? <laughs> what, no, 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 no. <laughs> it's, it's horrible, man. But like, what's, hor what's horrible is that like, by trying to do the right thing, he's going to, on some level, feel as if he created this scenario for that to happen yeah like by trying to protect her from yeah. something horrible happening he What's goes stay here happened? and if he would just let her go god knows what could have happened she could have got a car accident something like that but she stays and then allegedly this happens it's also it, it, like, like if, if she comes to you with that i have to 100 percent believe my friend is capable of doing this thing to go to the cops. If I believe it 95%, yeah. I guess I still go to the cops, but now I'm like, a part of me is like, I don't think, I can't see him doing and that. Then, like, he, I still gotta go to the cops? He went to you the, have to. He went to the cops and his lawyer, and I think that like he didn't come out and he tell the girl. It, yeah. Like he didn't tell the girl like what his name was or something like that immediately, but, and people are like, oh, he's trying to protect his friend, but I think his lawyer said, don't say anything else or something like that. Like, I think he was going by. Yeah the rules and what he was told by his lawyer, which is smart in that situation. Like, holy shit, this heinous crime happens at your home. Yeah. You know that you're going to be somewhat associated, and unfortunately, in trying to protect this girl, you told her to fucking stay. Ooh. You go feel guilty about that forever, bro. I mean, that's yeah. divine flaw. Yeah. I mean... Come on, Mark. Sacred Come flaw. Sacred flaw. I, how do I get it wrong every time? Sacred. Come on. Because you try to get flaw. God like... Yeah. I think the flaws yeah. fucked up. Bro. So what do you think? What do you think about this? You know, even just from a business standpoint, it's like, dude, the, all of his content's filmed at his house. His house is no longer safe. Oh wow! Like, no, I think a, that, there's a, just as no. I think that was wrong. It ha he rented a house in New. Does Kaisena stream from New York? I think this happened in New York. I don't think he stays. He lives in. New Maybe he's from New York, but I don't think he lives in New York, right? Or something. Maybe correct me if I'm wrong or something. As the the worst thing is what happened, but even the is collateral damages. Did it literally happen in the room where he records? Is it is? I in doubt his it. Room? I think he said go upstairs. My understanding uh, is he said go upstairs to his room. Nobody's gonna bother you. And it's, it seems like he films downstairs. I don't know what I'm basing that on, but it just feels like a basement to me. It does feel like a basement. But either way, right? cheese up. <laughs> but either way, it's like got basement. the whole. I'm not coming to your house if I'm a big Twitch woman. Like, yeah, no, your house is not safe. Mm -hmm. Fuck you yeah, yeah. About? And you also just gotta have a better crew. Like, yeah. Yo, what? If that's his friend, if that's just some random guy that showed up, like you can't really control that. I don't know nah, the, the nature nah, of what the this is. He, he says that was a friend of mine, yeah. which I, I respect him being honest about that and not distancing and being like, I barely know the guy. Yeah, he's like, yo, I, I was like somebody I thought I knew. It was a friend, that's and he's crazy. capable of this. That's crazy. Yeah, you just gotta have better company. How do you know? I mean, I'm sure nobody thinks anybody that is capable of that is capable of that for the most part. Yeah, I'm sure those the rapists have friends who are like. What? Him? Yeah. yeah. You yeah. fucking crazy? Yeah, nobody thinks their friend with a rapist. Is capable of pure <laughs> evil. Yeah. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. You wouldn't be friends with the guy who's capable of pure evil. Yeah. You might think he's a little shady, but pure evil? Yeah, that's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, or to create a system that, like, I guess you're not even thinking about it. You're like, yeah, no one's going to fuck with you. Mm. Or just, like, lock the door. I don't fucking know. Even if, like, someone comes in because, like, they're going to fucking so hook gotta, up with someone else in there. Like, you got to put, like, cameras in every room and make everybody aware there's cameras in every fucking room. If you sleep upstairs, you are on tape, but I'm doing this for your safety. <laughs> bro, Uber. Put her in the Uber? Oh, yeah. Yeah, she put her in the Uber. She out of there, bro. Yeah. You Is know, there? you're tracking the Uber. But the guy was the who. I think, dropped off. I think Kai was the host of the party, so he wasn't going to focus on it. He was focused on everybody in the party. He just have to focus on only one person. And according to what I heard, he didn't know the guy. He just met the, 
heard from the girl. He invited the girl a day before the party or something. He didn't know the girl. That's the same way he invited everybody in the party. She was not his father. He's not someone that she has kn- he's known for a long time. Someone he just found out about he invited everybody for the party and things went wrong from there or something. So it's not a party that you see we invited that specific so he was focused on. No. He invited many people. The party was filled up and it was a host, so he had to be going around meeting different people. Welcome to my party, you are you enjoying this do you want this like come on, how a host works. So when she sh- when he saw she was inebriated, he told her go up, sleep it up before you go home. So not what happened and shit went went wrong from there. Your house it's just like That's it. it gets messy. Even if you're doing the right thing, sending some, her out paying to house. send someone to their house. I don't know where she lives. I don't know what her situation is. Like spend whatever money it is. Yeah, uh, I disagree with that. Like it, the people in your crib, you should know who's in your crib. But you got a party, so now it's your friend's friend. Parties, it's your yeah. friend's nah. friend's friend. Like your house don't party. Don't have no fucking parties everybody. at the house that makes you millions of dollars for one thing. You know everyone at a house party. Like on, at, at my house party. If I threw a house party, come on, bro. come on. I'm not letting people. But this is what's fucked. He knew the I guy. Got all my stuff there. This like is, Al, huh. he knew this guy. He even if it's quite possible he had a party where he's like, I'm only having my homies. Yeah. I've known this guy since grade school. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. I don't think Kai did anything wrong. Yeah, no, like, we're not saying he did. Saying he did no, no, but I mean, you guys are saying, oh, you should have sent him, uh, sent her home. In we're the saying, Uber. what are better ways you could have handled that situation? Yeah, what if something happened? She's drunk in the Uber, and then the Uber driver takes advantage of her. You feel the same way? No, that's on the Uber driver. No, nah, you feel the same way. Yeah, you you like, sent her in that. You Uber remove to go yourself home. by one degree. Yeah, but then you remove still, your guilt you're by still one gonna degree. feel guilty. I mean, you feel guilty no matter what if something horrible happens to a woman. But you did the thing that you thought would protect her the most and put her in a safe position. You're at a public party. Like yeah, but what if she gets raped in the Uber going home? You could have just said, Al, "Damn, let me ask what if I question. just told her to sleep upstairs? You, that would have never happened." So yeah, it's not the exact. Al, same. let me ask you a question. Do you think that girls have ever been assaulted at parties before? Yes. So you do acknowledge that that does happen. And girls and have those been assaulted parties happen in where? In houses and clubs. So what's different? I didn't say clubs. Oh, okay. I'm just saying. So it's possible to happen in a house party. Yes. And it's also possible that there are people that end up getting invited to a house party that you might know peripherally, but not. Exactly like that close, and that's the thing. I don't have those types of house parties. Like you if don't, I ever, but if you I know ever that that's possible. Yeah, and a guy like Kai, who- and it says that Kai, like this is like he's coming out here. This twenty twenty two is like trying to celebrate this big year that was been for him. So he invited people that he didn't even know. So it was like a big house party, right? From what I heard, with like New Year, the New Year launch party for twenty twenty three and whatnot. And these are his twenty twenty three starts in a bad light. I just messed up. Any year 2022, like the big, the biggest high of your life, then 2023 just ends and starts and bam, bad year. Maybe in a different, you know, ballpark of, of fame is going to have all these people trying to get to a Kai party. And yeah. he's this guy who's hot and he knows rappers. And maybe there's a rapper that pulls up. A rapper not coming dolo. He's coming with his squad. And then maybe there's uh, somebody from movie, you know, other Twitch where everybody's rolling deep. Like, you invite me to a party, I'm rolling deep. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, if I go somewhere, you guys are with me, we all going. Yeah. Right? Now, I know you're not going to act a certain way, but what I'm trying to say is, like, the party is creating an environment where you can't entirely control. If you're having a small house party, it's one thing. You're having a party party. We are also kind of assuming, and it's fine, it's logical, but we are kind of assuming because we you don't, don't even know, know that everybody for sure. at your wedding. Like, we're assuming it's plus big. Plus ones or at your wedding. Yeah. We're assuming it's big, but we don't really know that. And again, it was his boy. Right. Well, I guess what I'm saying is the idea of. This person going home, yeah, is like this is this is a situation that you know that you've controlled, and now it's out of your hair. I think it's that's what I was going to push back on. I it's probably the safest thing to do in the Uber, but we can debate that. What you were, what you are doing it for? Okay, people. Sorry, I want to do something. And okay. also at the Good end back. of the day, I'm removing any culpability by one yeah. more degree mm-hmm. by putting you in Uber and get the fuck out of my house mm-hmm. in case my the people I'm around have some ill intentions. Mm. That's the thing, is culpability. I'm removing... All this is an afterthought. You'll be thinking of all this then. The guy was thinking, I tried, for him to actually even suggest for her to just stay upset so she won't be harmed or anything. It's actually a very, very good reaction to a party that is used when it's run up and that is not focused on. We're like, oh yeah, chill upstairs, come on, we are the, oh yeah, okay, you can ball out. That was a very, very good reaction. And then someone, you see this person is drunk, like, ah, okay, bye. Just ignore the person and go back to the party. 
No, that was a very different. That was a very different Myself, reaction. culpability wise, I put you in the Uber. That's all I could do. It's a party. There's drunk people here. If people try to come at me if I'm putting you in the Uber, I'm gonna be like, yo, I can't be responsible for 50 drunk people or how many drunk people I know they're yeah. gonna do. But I also, put you in the hands of a company that I trusted. Yeah. But that's another thing. Was like you never thinking you got rapists at your party. Exactly. Yeah. Nobody in history has ever gone. Yeah, I got rapists at my party. Let me protect. Which is again where you're thinking culpability wise. Put her in the Uber. Yeah, I can I can argue no, the opposite. I'm, yeah, I'm thinking, yo, let her stay here because if I let her out the house, something could happen, and then I feel bad that I let her out the house. Just sleep that shit off and then go home. That's what I'm saying. Like nobody is ever going. I got a rapist at my party. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like even if yeah. you got friends of friends, like you never at a bar and you're like, there's a rapist here. Yeah, that's that's again. I think I think I'm agreeing with y'all on that. Like I can push back on the safest thing being putting her in the Uber. But I can agree with the thing is going to get me in the least trouble if something weird happens. She's in the Uber. I'm not as culpable. So selfishly, you kind of got to put her in the Uber. Gotcha. Yeah, they, yeah, I know. And that's what I was thinking as well. But like, I realized, matter of fact, if anything happens to her, you're tied to it. <laughs> because even if you put her in the Uber, the question is now, how are you going to put a drunk girl in an Uber? That's what I was. That thinking. you are tied to this yeah. no matter what. I, and I, I was making the Uber, Uber argument, but now I'm thinking. You are tied to this. Why would you let a girl who's so drunk get into the fucking Uber? Yeah. And then they, now they're going to have video. Well, now nah, they're not going to use the video from the Uber because the Uber guy's doing it. But it's like, yeah, this is a fucked up situation. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, again, I think you're still culpable. I just think you're less culpable than it happened at my house, at my party. Now, True. to your point, you never think that's going to happen. Yeah. yeah. But I think you're just one degree of culpability less. Right. I had people at my party I didn't know. I didn't know what their intentions were. I just want to get her home. I apologize. But like... Yeah. Yeah, uh, a little bit less cold. The holidays is weird, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's true, man. But, but the odd thing is that Kaisenat tried to do the right thing, and the result was this. So is he culpable? Come on, man. The, his culpability is guilt. That should be the only thing. If, you, if you, he's guilt, if, if, if he feels guilty. Because most people are like, well, I didn't do it. It's not my business. They won't feel... Yeah, you can say that even from what the reactions online from Kai, you can say that yeah, he feels guilty, he feels heartbroken that shit like this happened at his own party, at his event he organized, and this kind of thing might deter someone from even doing some hosting a party like this again. God, my thing is messed up. Well, yo, hit the sub button, guys. Bye.